Dude, look at this. It's like a legit freaking water slide. That is straight gushing. Dude, there's a puddle down here. This could actually have some fish in it. Oh my God. Oh my God. Oh my God. Whew. All right, y'all. So this is kind of what's going on here. Me, Yak Pack, and Ryan are out here. And literally, this is just a random freaking pond in Alabama that we found on Google Maps. Like, we literally just went on Google Maps. We found these bodies of water. There's actually four ponds. Crazy thing about Alabama. Like, I know these boys are from Florida. They know some big fish. But I've just heard so many big fish stories from Alabama, dude. I, I think that there's a possibility. I don't know how long this pond has been here. But I feel like really anywhere you go in Alabama, there's a possibility for freaking 10-pound bass. So this is going to be interesting, man. We're going to see what we can do here. I will admit, though, one sketchy thing about this area as we were pulling in if it's not a sign i don't know what is there was a boxing <laughs> ring like a, a a a 10 foot by 10 foot boxing ring if somebody comes out here swinging man you got him right dude i got him i'm gonna take care of it <laughs> as i said this is my first time ever in alabama especially fishing so you know it, it might get a little interesting but i'm gonna get set up here the goal today is to explore and hopefully catch my personal best bass i miss so many of you guys like we'll talk about that in a different video at the Bassmaster classic like it was absolutely insane but i made sure to ask everybody like what is your personal best bass pretty much everybody's was bigger than mine so we got some work to do here man but yeah man let's get rigged up ryan's already over here swinging some stuff around let's get over here see what we can do man all right y'all so what we got tied on here real quick oh dude there's some bait fish down there i don't know i mean i should be throwing some kind of search bait or some kind of chatter bait or something we're gonna start off here with a little shaky head little finesse presentation i don't know why man it's just kind of calling my name so i'm just gonna kind of toss this around see if you know we don't even know if there's fish in these ponds man those in there's like a chain of four ponds here I, I mean i'd be happy if i just caught a fish this is looking good i already see some bait fish that are kind of around the shore here they're like some small little minnows and stuff so i mean look at the, the water color looks good we got some wind bro look at that shaky head I, I, action i, I can too. literally just imagine a 12 pound bass somewhere in this pond dude it's freaking alabama man what reel sounds better ready first aid's got another dc reel right here that's mine first ready little bird in this action. <laughs> hit him, hit him. Alright, let's try it. Yours. I feel like they kind of sound the same, honestly. Mine's a little, like, deeper. Look at that pipe literally right here, bro. You can tell this is an old body of water. Sure. Come on, shaky head. I've literally never fished anywhere for bass. Besides Florida and North Carolina. Dude, look how good. Like, I wonder if I could skip it into this pipe right here a little bit. You got him? Oh my god, he's big. Oh, dude. What the? <laughs> what, did he bite? That's a pretty aggressive stick right there, dude. Oh, no, yeah. This looks like the sauce over here. Oh, dude, the water is coming in from that pond to this pond. It's like a little waterfall action. They got some pipes over here. Yo, th if there's going to be any fish in this water, I feel like this. Holy crap, that looks so good. I need to make a cast over there, dude. Oh, dude, you see that right there? Uh -huh. All right, I think this whole time we've been fishing the wrong side of the pond. I usually always like to fish the windblown bank first. This is definitely, like the wind is pretty strong today. So we're gonna try over here a little bit, see if we get bit. If not, we're gonna switch up something else. I'm just, I don't know, man, I have a really good feeling that this thing we got on going on right here. Just kind of twitch it a little bit, twitch it a little bit. Oh, I got bit. I'm getting bit. That was a good sign. I don't know. My GoPro kind of turned off, but I had my first little nibble out here. It's definitely fish. They say they got some nibbles too. I don't know if it's smaller fish. Ryan said he had a big hit too. Just wiggle this thing around down there a little bit. Gotta be. Like, someone's gotta hit this, right? I mean, my freaking GoPro turned off. Oh, all right. Well, there we go. First fish of the day. Tiny little dude, man. Of course, the freaking GoPro. Oh, he got hooked weird too. Bottom of that lip there. What is good, my guy? That was so weird. I don't know why the freaking GoPro shut off. All right, first fish of the day. Giant, bro. Giant. Whoa. That's called an Alabama giant. That's a state right there, bro. <laughs> state, what do you call a game warden? That's a state record. Hey, man, that dude hit so weird too. He didn't even like, like he just gulped it, and I felt like a thumb. That's crazy. All right, let's let you go, buddy. Oh, I think he's got it. Does he have it? Oh. Dude, there's one. Second fish of the day. Around the same size as the first one. Oh my god, bro. Look at this cute little dog. Hello? Hello? Oh my god, there's another one. Oh, he's got like a big ball under his head. I don't know who the heck's dog those are. Ooh, there's that wind. It actually feels really... Dude, it's like warm out here in Alabama today. It's like a nice... I mean, it feels like mid-60s this year today. Nice, coolish breeze coming at you, man. This is like a perfect... 
It's a beautiful day, man. That wind is really starting to whip, though. Oh. Yo. This looks so freaking sick, dude. Holy crap. All right, so there's a pipe coming up from this pond. This is the pond we were fishing in the other pond over there. Dude, look at this. It's like a legit freaking water slide. That is straight gushing. Dude, there's a puddle down here. This could actually have some fish in it. Yo, that looks freaking deep, too. Hold on a second. If I catch a fish out here, man, this tiny little puddle, that is going to be one of the coolest freaking things I have ever done. I mean, literally, this is it's like a freaking bass water slide. There's no way that a fish has never gone down that pipe, slid down here, had the ride of his life, and gone right into this puddle, man. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. There's a freaking bass down here, dude. <laughs> oh, my freaking God. Okay. Holy freaking crap. Yo, he's a little guy. Tiny puddle. Like, this is absolutely freaking insane man look at that but like, you know this little dude went right down into that little thing so what i'm gonna do actually i don't know if you guys can tell but this this puddle is just it, it's what it is it's a little puddle now this is my first time ever at this pond i don't know you know if this is usually a thing i think they actually had a lot of rain i don't know if you guys see super muddy around here so what i'm gonna do i'm actually gonna bring this fish all the way back up here i don't know maybe he likes the puddle if he does he could just go right back through but pretty much, man, if that puddle dries up, because, you know, I don't know how much rain, as I said, you know, they've really had in the past couple days. And I got to get him back in the water quick before he freaking croaks out here. I don't know when that puddle is going to dry up. I mean, it looks like it's going down pretty fast, but there's no way, it, you know, it, it's going to have to rise a lot to get over that. Let's let him go up here real quick, man. Fish rescue in action. You good, buddy? Oh, jeez. By the way, he can go through this pipe again if he wants, like, if that's really his home. His true love is down there. But what I'm thinking, th there's not really good source of food down there. My concern is that drying up. I just think that that is the best thing for these fish. I gotta go show them this spot, man. This is freaking crazy, dude. Let me see real quick. Actually, yo, this thing might be loaded with fish. Literally just random freaking puddle. All right, let's get this dude back out there. I'm telling you guys, man, this is like actually one of the coolest things I've probably done in a while. Just the fact that he bit like that too. I mean, I barely cast it in here. He must've been a hungry little guy, man. So hopefully that dude is gonna grow up one day be a 10 pounder and we're gonna come back to Alabama. Yeah, you know, we're just gonna lock eyes and he's gonna know. It's deep, man. I mean, I see a cinder block right down there, but down there, I mean, this has gotta be a couple feet deep, which is actually kind of insane. Oh, dude. Yo, I literally just saw, yo, there's actually more bass in here too. This is literally a bass slip and slide. That, I've never seen a pipe that's just gushing like that, man. It's like big enough for me to go down it too. Yo, imagine. Oh, oh, dude, second fish. Holy freak. Yo, literally out of the freaking puddle, dude. Oh my, what in the heck? Literally on the top of his mouth too. Switched over to the Ned rig. Dude, <laughs> yo, there's fish in this freaking puddle, dude. This is like the craziest spot. Oh my God. So I put on the little Ned rig. There's a nice little football on the ground right there. Oh, yo. I was casting in here earlier, but it was with a big worm. You caught him on the Ned rig? Yeah, I caught, dude, that's my second one in here, bro. They're not the biggest fish, but I feel like I, I definitely should move them back up to the bigger pond. All right, we're gonna go rescue this dude. It is super freaking muddy. This is actually like, this is probably one of the craziest things I've ever done. Let me stick you guys in here for a second, dude. Literally, look at that giant spider web out there. So this dude literally just whoo, down tiny puddle. I, dude, do you see this where we're at right now? I've never seen like a cooler fish water slide type thing. This fish literally had to come out and it was just So I don't know how long, you know, this water supply is going to go down there. I don't know if they have food in there. Imagine they're in the puddle too and a bird comes and like, I don't know, man. Hopefully Imagine we're going to. this fish going down this. <laughs> Yo, this fish probably had the time of his life, bro. Once I put him back out there, he's probably going to come back down. He's a thrill seeker. All right, let's go do that real quick. <sighs> Yo, freaking yak bag just caught one up here. This is actually kind of, yo, I, I'm low-key tempted. Like, I'm not going to put him down the slide, but I think that would be pretty freaking cool. But I don't think that would be the nice thing to do. We're trying to help these fish out. Oh, maybe, I don't know, maybe he wants to go down the slide. Oh, dude, my freaking knee is about to... Oh. Hey, there he goes. Let's go, dude. Hopefully that fish as well. It's going to grow to be big. Dude, look at this giant freaking anthill, though. I accidentally stepped in one of these earlier, and just they all came. Yeah, they were so angry. All right, let me get... How the heck should I get back down here? This is, I know they're not big fish and hopefully we're gonna catch a big fish today. Okay, this is real sketch. Oh! There's even more dogs up there barking. This is, this is fun, man. Even if there's like, it's, it's just insane. Never in my life have I seen such a cool little spillway puddle looking thingy. But yeah, I'm gonna throw this around a little bit more here. Let's, let's see what happens with it. 
Oh, that's a bite, dude. Oh, I'm getting nipped. Nip, nip, nip. Oh, there's a fish. Oh, what the hell? <laughs> Yo, what in the heck, dude? That is like the smallest bass. Like, that Ned rig is li like, he cannot even, like, what? I don't know how the heck that fit in your mouth, little dude. Oh, he's got some little teeth on him, too. Oh, let me get a close up of it. Like, he's actually got some teeth, teeth, bro. That is the smallest bass I've ever seen in my life. <laughs> dude, Alabama, bro. Thank you so much for biting, buddy. I knew something was like pecking at it. I gotta admit that that is like a really, really, really pretty little fish. I don't know if that's weird to say because he's so young, but. Let you, oh, there he goes, yo. Let's go, dude. We're out here, man. We're catching them. We're doing big things, big Alabama bassing. Hey, man, all I gotta say is where there are fish, there are small fish, and there could be some freaking mondos. Whoa, oh, that's, is that a fish? Oh, oh. we got him a little three pounds. <laughs> Bro, I swear. Sheesh. Hey, man, she's a, a that man, that's a big one right there, man. Definitely need to show this one off. She fought like crazy, bro. <laughs> Holy crap. Yo, Ryan just caught oh a freaking bass out of the puddle. Oh my god. <laughs> Dude, yo, <laughs> yo, your freaking crocs fly off, bro. Bro, it was right in that current. I thought these were gonna go down the freaking water slide when I saw them fly off. Look at that, man. A little, little sneaker oh, yeah. wash. Oh, 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 yeah. Oh my god. Yo, 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 that actually be kind of sick if you like drop the croc from like the hole all the way to the top. Oh my god. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, I just had an idea, bro. Y'all should have a freaking croc race down the thing. <laughs> oh, bro. All right, we're gonna get out of here. If anything, I feel like we gave those fish a better shot at life, a lot bigger space, more forage and stuff. So definitely, I mean, if they want to go down, like back down in that hole, they can go back down. You know, maybe they want to. This is a cool day, man. First ever Alabama fish. <coughs> I just swallowed a bug, bro. We caught some fish in some kind of interesting ways. Nothing big, but I mean, it's a good time, man. You wanna know just where? Well.